Hello, my Capricorns. Welcome back. All right, we're going to take a peek into you and see what's going on, whatever I can pick up on. This is a general reading, so please take what resonates. I don't want to hear it. No offense. <laughs> I think this is kind of the energy though the Capricorn is taking on. That's why I'm communicating this way. So I'm just I'm just vibing with you, Cappy. I'm just, <laughs> if you would like to book a personal reading with me, link to my website is in the description box below. Okay, so first, you I think that you're bothered. You're bothered and a little disappointed is what I'm picking up on, but I don't think you're disappointed and bothered by something that you have done. I feel like necessarily, I mean, take how this resonates, but I'm picking up something that has to do with a masculine energy. Um, it's possible that they're younger than you, or you might just kind of have this attachment or feel protective over this masculine, whoever they are. But I think you, you could possibly be disappointed like in a decision that was made or something along these lines. Like it, it, this may be a family member or again, it, it, it doesn't matter exactly. It'll vary for all of you, whoever it, this resonates with. Again, I feel, I feel the need to say that again. But yeah, I'm just seeing you being a little bit like, okay, I don't, something doesn't sit well with you. But it's interesting because it's uh, in regards to yourself, I feel like you don't really need to worry. That's why I get this like protective energy over whoever this person is. Now, um, there and there is a little bit of mental conflict coming up in regards to the element of love and romance and those that you care about. You may be guarding your heart. A lot of you Capricorns have had relationships in the past where there was like some form of hostility or, or just conflict the word that's coming to mind is abuse but i don't know that won't apply to everybody but it could be mental or physical but i'm just getting that like you're like a little bit protective you might be you know focusing on what you want what your heart wants because you're guarded I do see someone here that is determined for your attention that wants to kind of fight for your heart. They they'll kind of they'll say something like this to you if they haven't already at some point. But they they are and they may feel like they need to they have competition or they just know. They know how you are, they know that you're guarded and but they're they're going to they're in this energy of wanting to fight for you. Even if it takes a while, you know, I don't know if you're focusing on them though. For some reason, I feel like your, your energy is focusing. Like I see, I see Capricorn looking down when somebody's trying to, so you might be focusing on something else again, more personal, personal to you. And then beware of something involving the past or individuals from the past. Some, something here is a trap, but you, you're going to intuitively kind of sense this whenever this pops up. Um, you may have tried whatever this is before and it didn't really, you're like, yeah, I didn't really get much from that. You know, that's what I'm picking up. Like you've tried this before. It's going to resurface around, especially in um, mm -hmm. as Mercury mm -hmm. slows down. Uh, there could be communication or, or talk again of something that you, that is reminding of the past or coming back from the past type of deal. And it feels like, it feels like you're like, mm, no, I don't kind of lost out on that last time I tried to do. It's a trap. That's what they're saying. And, and you will, your intuition is not wrong because I'm getting that you will kind of, mm, might be tempting to you. But it, but it is, it's a trap. Okay, let me go ahead and pull some cards. Universe, connect me with the energy for Capricorn, please. 
sun, moon, rising, and Venus. What messages do you have for Capricorn? What's going on for the Capricorns, please? Whoops. Show me what's going on for the Capricorns. Can't quite get a hold of the cards, can I? Whoops, too many. See, whoops, whoops, there's a lot of whoops. What's going on here? Capricorn, show me the Capricorn. Okay. Hope and then throat chakra. I'm getting a healing conversation or a conversation that possibly almost like an understanding. You're going to have an understanding with a person where there where feelings were hurt here. Yeah, it seems it seems like this it could come in the form of a heart to heart or something along these lines. I am also seeing that you know the things that you say have a lot of potential to enlighten others i'm getting an enlightenment in through conversation and words now it's interesting though because in regards to partnerships specifically those that are more on a business or professional level um or an, envir an environment where you invest time, you know, this could be kind of weighing on you. Conflict, defeat, deception, and envy, prosperity begins. So I'm getting like, it's not really a lack of money or a lack of that coming back, but y you know, there's individuals that, that you can't trust. I would, especially at this time frame, check all money just be very you know keep an eye on accounts money going out with work and personal because i'm getting something about there could be a little bit of a glitch or a mistake or something going on with money you need to watch your money very carefully and and because some people might be making mistakes or some people might be intentionally doing things i don't know i'm just getting like you know it could be a lot of burden for you in regards to the work environment but I'm feeling like it's something that you deal with because there's there's a good partnership here. So you may have a good relationship with um, a business ally that's involved or a boss or something along these lines. Like there's benefits financially. There's, you, you know, bonuses or things like that. Like there's reason to partner with this particular company or this person or to work with it. But, you know, you just have to deal with a lot. There's people that just don't get it. The people, people that are jealous, people that, you know, I'm dealing, like, you're dealing with multiple different types of individuals. And this could be kind of defeating for you and exhausting. Okay. All right. So what else? What's coming up for Capricorn, please? You might get a payout or some sort of uh, receive appreciation or be recognized for how you handle or what you say. I don't know. Yeah, how you handle a situation, what you say, what you do, both. All right, what, what else is coming up for Capricorn? They're saying, um, hold on to your money in this time frame. But for those of you that, you know, maybe have spent more or experienced experiencing a, a dryness in funds, this will end. But I would just be, again, I got this energy with someone else as well. You may, and again, you're going to be seeking to 
kind of get away from and move on from things that are very burdening, traumatic. Um, there's a situation that you could be kind of like avoiding in the future or just like, yeah, I kind of need to end this. I don't really, you know, some of you may need to not spend so much money or I don't know. I'm getting like an element of you sort of planning. Okay, so how can I move forward? And, and I want to focus on balance you know, financial balance. I don't think you'd necessarily have a money issue for most of you per se, but I get that there's like a lot of burden in regards to finances and work and things like that. And, and you may put in a lot in work and in situations with people and you're not really getting as much back as much as what you put in and you're kind of over that. I feel you really kind of being over that. And two of, two of wands, six of pentacles, really looking towards planning Okay, how can I make things more reciprocal? Situations, I want situations that are going to give back to me, to where I feel received. Um, making a plan, again, how to increase some sort of money balance for some of you. Yeah, so you're really in this planning phase because whatever it is that some of the things that you're dealing with might be just too draining for you. So um, in this time frame, that's really what I'm picking up on Capricorn. So I think I was kind of repeating. This is like a, you know, a lot of strength. Your your energy is, you're, you are strong, but you're in a guarded state. But I understand why based on the cards that I'm pulling. So um but there is hope and there is like a good conversation coming where you're like, oh, thank goodness. But, you know, you're still kind of looking forward to the future like, okay, all right. Okay, bye-bye.